fun, the excitement of it all, the pressure, the, you know, all of it all put together, it just makes you keep coming back. It's a day that comes only once a year, <laughs> Connecticut Day at the Big E. New England's biggest fair honors our state today. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Kevin Hogan took the weather tracker and marched in the parade along with Channel 3's Eva Zamaris and Aya Galal. He also sent in this sample of sights and sounds. Connecticut people rocked it out today at the Big E with music by Connecticut's own Savage Brothers Band outside. Inside, thousands of people checking out Connecticut grown or made products. It's the first year here for Lyric Hill Farm. As owner Nancy Butler shows me, goat soap art. The soap is handmade, wrapped in decorated felted wool. As you use it, the wool shrinks around the bar, gets smaller. It's like an eco-friendly shrinky dink. You end up with a little pad of wool with a pattern and on it. And it still holds the product. Yes. And check this out. Maple Craft Foods from Sandy Hook. This is bourbon barrel maple syrup? Yes, it is. Oh, wow. We get that flavor just from the barrel. It sits in a uh, bourbon barrel from Litchfield Distillery. Five to six months to get that fit flavor. Talk about friendly. Danny's Smokehouse Grill with a giant spud that's a meal unto itself for many. The food and the baked potato. Yeah. We come every year. <laughs> I got the butter with the cheese and the pulled pork. Danny's been doing the Big E for 18 years, baking his pound and a half taters for 90 minutes before his team of spudsters loads up the goodies. Real butter, real cheese, real sour cream. We'll top it off with pulled pork and chili or broccoli and cheese. You know, it's, it's uh, it's quite a meal. And the crowds just Thank love you. it every year. How does that taste? Good. With the mobile newsroom at the Big E in West Springfield, Kevin Hogan, Channel 3, Eyewitness News. Kevin.